For me, it was just jump in with both feet. It's exciting though. We feel like it's going in the right direction. Uh, we like the way recruiting shaped out. Um, love my staff that I put together. Um, and uh, the team that, that uh, we're working with now, they're starting to round into their own and, and uh, I think uh, some good basketball's on the horizon. Really for me, I, I tell the team the whole, uh, you know, all year long that it's not who we play, it's how we play. We're going to take charges. We're going to dive on the floor. We're going to do those toughness things. We're, we're not going to be a finesse basketball team. We just are going to put a brand on the floor that hopefully night in and night out is consistent. It's consistent in terms of effort. It's consistent in terms of toughness. We're going to rebound the basketball, uh, and we're going to make it tough on you to score. Uh, and then we're going to play off that defense, and we're going to push it down your throats and lay it up as much as we can. Uh, we're going to live on the free throw line. Those are the things that no matter who we're playing, that's how we're going to play. Teams are going to know what they're getting when they uh, line up across from us. Um, that consistency that, that we come out every day with uh, is a big, big part of that. Discipline is a big, big part of that. I think you're seeing the start of a conference season that uh, hopefully is mirroring that attitude. You know, I think if you come in and, and your message is different day to day and, and it, you almost react to the players' moods or anything along those lines, um, that, that message is going to get lost. It's always tough for players, you know, in this situation where, you know, they really have to uh, put a lot of faith in the administration that they hired the right guy and, and then in me that, uh, you know, they're just going to do it my way from day one. And, um, you know, to be honest with you, um, we had the majority of the group buy into it and we had some that it just wasn't for them and that's fine too. And, and anytime you're changing a culture, um, you know, it's, uh, it's a pretty simple decision. You know, you're either in or you're out. You know, you have to believe in it first and foremost, and, and I think when they see that, uh, it's easy to get behind it and, and start uh, living your life that way. I, I think the kids have done a really good job, the Brandy Woodies, the Katie Murphys of the world. Um, they, they've been really good in, in that capacity. And then for us, the first question, and honestly, the last one is character. Um, I, I want players that uh, understand the importance of being in class. I want the players that uh, understand that 24-7 uh, they're a part of women's basketball here at Ball State. It, it, it isn't just two hours during the day. Um, and, and I want people to walk around and look at our players and know um, that they're character first. I think when you get that total package together, all of a sudden you start seeing that success follow and, and uh, that's what we're after here at Ball State.